a line of ATVs on a hill. It's a picture many of us have in our minds from trips with friends or maybe a jamboree outing. It's an image that symbolizes everything we love about the outdoors, adventure, exploration, family bonding. Today outside Florence, Arizona, Charles Lutz, owner of Arizona ATV Adventures, is taking a tour group out into the wilds of Box Canyon. Some of them are experiencing a trip by ATV for the very first time, and this is their introduction to that world. When it comes to history and beauty, they'd be hard pressed to find a better primer than this. Today we uh, took our tour, Arizona ATV Adventures. We went uh, about 34 miles, and we explored uh, an area known locally as Box Canyon. Box Canyon is a uh, kind of special. It was a shortcut used by the Butterfield Stagecoach Company during the 1800s between Globe, Arizona and Florence. The canyon itself, uh, there are places where the walls are up to 800 feet high on both sides and the riverbed that we rode down, there are places where it's only 15 feet wide. The desert has a beauty all its own and out here with the towering cacti and expansive blue skies, that fact is readily apparent. The town of Florence is about 50 miles southeast of Phoenix. By heading east from downtown on the 60 freeway for about 30 miles and then heading south on Highway 79, you find this arid place of surprising green. The ride through the desert toward Box Canyon takes you through this environment and is very eye-opening since you would think that no plants could survive in such a dry place. Once you enter the canyon, the ride takes on a more intimate feel, what with the close quarters and sheer walls while pioneer in Native American history is apparent as well, some of it reaching back 80 or 90 years, and some even further. The canyon itself tells the tale of the struggles that existed in the Arizona Territory in the not too distant past. It got its name because at that time in the 1860s, we were at war with the Chiricahua Apaches, and they would climb up the side of the canyon walls and push down boulders to block the stagecoach as it came through. Then they'd go down and kill the driver and passengers, and steal any jewelry or weapons. And uh, they would essentially box in the stagecoach, and that's where it got its name. Arizona ATV Adventures leads tours out of the Florence area, but Tucson and Sedona as well, taking riders through lands so epic that they've been filmed in countless movies since the early days of Hollywood. I mean, you know, John Wayne, Yul Brynner, Jackie Cooper, these guys have all walked down the trails you're riding down. It's really neat. And, you, you know, it's easy to prove. One of the things that I thought was interesting that I learned about riding Box Canyon that actually has nothing to do with the canyon is that Charles and Arizona ATV Adventures are actually the only permitted tour agency. Not because he got exclusive rights, but because the permitting process itself has become so expensive for the government, what with environmental surveying that needs to be done and processing requirements, that they've kind of put the lid on it, so to speak which is something that doesn't seem quite right to Charles. So I got a call one day about, now it's been 10 years ago, and uh, they said, well, congratulations, you hold the only permit, and we don't anticipate that there'll be another one even considered in two, until 2024. Okay, <laughs> I have a, a government-issued monopoly. It's incredible, but that's what's going on. That fact does add to the mystique of Box Canyon, but luckily, you can legally ride the area on your own without a guide if you so wish. Charles will even point you in the right direction since he wants everyone to see the beauty of his backyard and experience the delight of an ATV excursion. Many of us have fond memories of trail rides through the wilds of the western U.S. that have framed our very lives in scenes like these. A line of ATVs on the horizon means adventure is right around the corner. And whether you're in the middle of historic Arizona lands or just exploring your favorite loop, there will always be something new to find when you ride the trail. People are loving it. They came here because they wanted an outdoor activity, and they sure got one. From outside Florence, Arizona, I'm Stephen Human for At Your Leisure.